You've all heard of the Stone Age, the Bronze Age. We live currently in the Plastic Age. By the year 2050, if we continue generating plastic pollution at the rate that we are now, we're going to have more plastics than fish in the oceans. We don't have that much time. Humans have this relationship with our things, with our materials, where after we use them, we just throw them away. It just felt really wrong that adults in the world were not doing the right thing, and they were not even talking about it. They were hiding this thing. So if we had a way to be able to properly break down that plastic into usable plastic to recirculate back into the economy, then that would be something revolutionary. Miranda is the only child. Sometimes when Jenny come, it's like I suddenly I have two daughters. <laughs> <laughs> I actually had a really tough time in high school. And I remember I would reach out to Jeannie and she was just so wonderfully supportive in those in those times. And I think that really solidified our, our friendship. You know, we were just like two kids out of Vancouver in our first year of college. We didn't let the fact that we were students in high school stop us. I think it showed us that, that we can dream bigger and we can take on, you know, a more um, active role as, as change makers in the world. I was standing